I just think this mode is, is really good for anyone skiing because rhythm is such an important key thing to have in your skiing. Hi, my name's Tom Gelly. I'm a level four ski instructor and today I'm skiing with Carve's Metronome Challenge. So the Metronome Challenge gets you to set a specific rhythm. So you get to choose the rhythm. So I'm gonna go down here, choose a rhythm and after five consistent turns of that rhythm, Carve recognizes that and sets it. And then I've got with my ear pods here, audio feedback to keep me skiing at that rhythm. So this is a really interesting concept because rhythm has been shown to be a really good performance enhancing tool. So if you have something to focus on like a, a, a rhythm, all the movements you make in skiing will be directed towards achieving that. And it's really been shown that these kind of focuses outperform thinking about your feet and your legs. So I'm really excited to go test it. So let's hit start and I'll run you through exactly what I'm hearing as I go. Welcome to the Metronome Challenge. Ski more than five turns in a row to set a rhythm, then keep skiing at so, that rhythm. I've got to ski five turns in a row at a particular rhythm and then try and keep that rhythm. And this run isn't the same slope all the way down, it dips up and down. So that'll be a good challenge to see if I can stay at that rhythm. Let's get a little speed up. <coughs> so I'm gonna set the rhythm now. Rhythm set. Try to keep your rhythm. Got my rhythm. So I've got the feedback. Turn. And I'm going to stop. And let's see what she says. You just ski 1% faster rhythm. than the target rhythm. Whoa, awesome. So she's just told me I'm 1% faster than the target rhythm. So that's pretty much spot on the rhythm. So that's great, o automatic feedback. And I've got this metronome, just an audio sound, keep me on the beat. I'm really interested to see what happens when I go off beat. So first I just got to set the rhythm. So maybe we'll do a bit quicker. Rhythm set, try to keep your rhythm. So I've got the beat. I'm going to be so a bit slower, I think, and let's see what's happening. You just skied 9% slower than the target rhythm. Yeah, right. So 9% slower than the rhythm that I'd set. So it's really cool. It tells you whether you're ahead of the rhythm or behind it. And I just think this mode is, is really good for anyone skiing because rhythm is such an important key thing to have in your skiing because through tougher sections, when the terrain changes like that, the ability to keep on a rhythm focuses all your attention, all your skills to just that. So I think it's an awesome mode. Um, let's go try out the next one. 